Hey there guys, Comic Beast here with a special Christmas gift unboxing. Um, kind of a Christmas gift. I got an Amazon gift card for Christmas. And there was something on there that I had had my eye on for a while. Was just was just waiting, you know, just in case the hol well, for when the holidays came around in case I got a gift card. And I did, so uh I bought myself a little something. And it's not necessarily a comic book, but it is comic book related. I waited a while to get this, um, and I'm really, really excited that I was finally able to pick it up. So, let it's one of those tear open boxes, so let me tear this open really quickly and show you guys what I got. So, hold on a second. Okay, so I pulled the tab most of the way open, just let me tear it off right there. Slide this out. Just want to make sure I don't get the packaging slip. Too exposed, and you guys can probably tell what it is. Oh, no packaging slip. Okay, sweet. So throw the box over there. And I ordered myself the limited edition version of Man of Steel. Um, comes with the 3D Blu-ray, the Blu-ray Blu-ray, the DVD, and a digital HD Ultra by the copy. Um, apparently this set was limited to 50,000 pieces, and I got number 3,000, 30,000, sorry, 695. Um, I know, I just loved it because it's like a steel case of the S. Um, with all the DVDs housed inside, and this is the back of the box. It shows the actual, like, display, what it looks like, and it comes with the four discs. I'm really excited to open this up. Um, there was a lot of exclusives around, like, I know Target had their own exclusive. Walmart, I think, had their own, and so did Best Buy. There were a lot of exclusive, um... Like special features and packagings and stuff like that. Like Target had a digital book with a lenticular like changed from Zod to to Superman and I think Best Buy had like a bonus disc with extra content and you know there was a lot of stuff out there. Um but this is the one that caught my attention the most. It was I think like forty bucks. Um, all the other ones were like twenty five, thirty dollars. So I I don't know. I didn't mind spending an extra, um, an extra ten bucks, ten to fifteen dollars on this, especially because got a gift card for Christmas. So why not? So let me try. I'm wondering if I should do this with one hand. nothing to open this up so let me let me open this up and then I'll I'll come back try to set it up and show you guys what's inside and everything okay so after some required assembly which was kind of difficult for me um I finally got this up it is an actual standing comes with a tin case with a standing uh with a stand for it and the stand actually if you look in the back the stand actually has three magnets um, that actually hold it up so that it sticks securely to the base. And so that's great for displaying and I kind of make some room on one of my shelves to, to actually display that. And this is the actual, okay, this is the first time I've seen this. Uh, as I didn't didn't look at it before I am showing you guys. Um, comes with the four discs, 3D Blu-ray. Oh wow, that's nice. Uh, 3D Blu-ray, the DVD, the film, and the special features. So it comes with all the four discs. Um, and yeah, just awesome display. Like it's odd right there. Kal El, Superman. And then the family crest, as it appeared, I believe, on Jarrell's um, actual suit. So, oh, this is this is really nice, really awesome. Um, in the back, like if it's Jarrell's cape, 
that's really cool um so yeah i think this is this is well worth the wait for me um big superman fan i really liked the movie it took me a took me a little while to uh to to warm up to it at first i'm not gonna lie uh that ending scene where it's like a spoiler alert where superman snaps zod's neck kind of put me off at first and then i went back and thought about it and i was like you know for for what it was it was a really good movie it was a really good superman movie a lot of action and just something that, that Superman needed, especially with that last one that was another Lex Luthor villain film. Um, but yeah, General Zod was so crazy in this and I don't know, I think it was a I think it was a really really good job. I can't wait for for Batman, Superman, Superman versus Batman. Man of Steel 2 or Justice League, whatever they're trying to do right now, I just oh, can't wait for it. But again, thanks you guys. Thank you guys for watching. This is the Man of Steel Collector's Edition unboxing with Comic Beast. Thank you guys again for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And have a good night.